Welcome to our virtual alumni reunion tour of Hancock Whitney Stadium. I'm here with Southpaw to guide you through the day. We're starting in the north part of the footprint of the stadium with our administration building behind us. You can see a four-story building. The first story is made up of the locker rooms, home and visiting. The home locker room was named by Max and Audrey Goldberg. The second story was named by the Mobile County Commission and it is our Mobile County Commission Center for Student Athlete Success. It serves all of our student athletes and all of our sports. And the third and the fourth floor are central administration units where for the first time ever, administratively, we're all in the one place at one time working together. Here we have our game day locker room. This is a locker room that will be used just on game days. We have an everyday locker room up in the football field house. As you can see, this is very spacious, plenty of room for the kids to get ready for the game, plenty of room for Coach Campbell to be able to talk to the, the kids either before the game or at halftime or post game. So uh, very clean, very spacious, a great space for us to get ready to play. Welcome to the second floor. This is the Mobile County Commission Center for Student Athlete Excellence. This is a very generous space in which all our student athletes can receive academic support from tutoring, individual tutoring, the group tutoring, counseling to advising, a computer lab, a collection of 12 individual study spaces where students can, can have peace and quiet and, and some uh, conducive space for studying. Welcome to the fourth floor of the administration building. Come on into the athletic director's suite, the small conference room facing the field. And connected to this office is a hospitality area. Behind the, the shaded glass are senior administrative offices. This is a space that has a great view of the field. Windows open at each side so people can hear the game environment. And this conference room then opens up to a main work area. Okay, we're back outside at Hancock Whitney Stadium, so I'm gonna take my mask off. Behind us here we see our concourses. We're currently located in the northwest section of the stadium. The west side is where the press tower is seen that you can see behind me. You'll notice that we have very spacious concourses and there's a reason for that. The concourses are spacious, so when we decide to expand the stadium from 25,000 to 32,000 and to 40,000, we can do so easily. Some of the parts that are, are very key to the success of the stadium people never see, so you have a chance to see here in the press tower, we're, we're in the press tower now on the ground level, and to the north end of the ground level are all the utilities, the heat, the cooling, the water access for the tower, and again, our engineers have done a spectacular job in making sure we're state-of-the-art in the way that we create comfort for our customers and our fans. Welcome to the second floor of the press level. This is called the Hargrove Club. Follow us. The Hargrove Club has an interior component that we're in now. This is a about a 25 foot by 60 yard long uh, area in which people who have club seats and low seats have access to before and during the game. The club seating section if you look at the blue seats immediately adjacent to us but below us, those are approximately 660 club seats, individual seats. What we have that I'm standing in here is called a lodge. A lodge is an area in which a person purchases a space and you have a desktop, a tabletop, in which to place your drinks or your beverages and your food. You also have an outlet to plug in your handheld device because we all don't want to run out of energy for our handhelds. And four movable seats. Welcome to the third floor of the press tower. This is the suite level. We're going to take you into the president's suite, which is right at the 50 yard line. 
Within each of the suites are both an indoor section and an outdoor seating. So suite holders are outside, they're under the cover of roof for rain and mobile, and a tremendous view of the game and the field. Every great college football game needs a grand entrance. Here at Hancock Whitney Stadium, we have one. They'll go down a tunnel, take a right to the main entryway to the tunnel, and then when the timing is right, they take the field and they get ready for the game. Now we're down on the playing surface. Uh, at Hancock Whitney Stadium is Abraham A. Mitchell Field. Mr. Mitchell, as he always has been, was very generous and gracious with his contribution to make the stadium a reality. And so the field, the surface we're standing on, has his name on it in two places, on the field and then also on the press tower. Uh, the Michelob Ultra Terrace is the result of a generous gift of the Budweiser Bush distribution people. We appreciate their support. We can separate it into three different sections that can accommodate 100 people per group. And then the unique thing about the middle part of the Michelob Ultra Terrace is the upper level is actually portable. We removed the middle fencing, the back terrace, moves forward, drops down to the front terrace, and becomes a stage that's about 80 foot long by 60 feet deep. And then to have the video board behind the stage, we think it's a tremendous setting for a concert here at Hancock Whitney Stadium. In the building to the south of the stadium, underneath the video board, you'll see uh, our main ticket office with eight ticket windows, and then Jaguar locker room, which is an extension of our campus bookstore that will have a, a, an abundance of Jaguar gear on game days. Uh, the, the store will be open prior to the gates opening. And then after the gates are open, it'll be open from the interior part of the stadium. So people that are here on game day will have a beautiful place to come in, get their Jaguar gear and cheer for the Jags. Thank you for joining us today for our tour of Hancock Whitney Stadium. We hope you enjoyed it. We hope you're proud of this beautiful stadium and how it's gonna impact campus. Make your plans today to join us when you can. Circle that date, get your tickets, and come join me in Southpaw for some South Alabama football. Go Jags. Thank you for joining us today for our virtual alumni reunion. Hope you enjoyed today's events as much as we enjoyed bringing them to you. Although we would much rather be able to visit with you in person, I'm grateful for this opportunity to connect with you virtually and share a small part of what's happening on our beautiful campus, in our healthcare system, and throughout the USA community. As soon as possible, we will make plans to see you on campus, and we're all looking forward to that day. Please join me now in seeing the USA alma mater and fight style, and as always, go Jags.
nestled midst the hills of pine, enduring throughout time. Upward, onward, may your fame continue in its climb. So with thy blessings now send us, pray that highest 